welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial today we are going to create this simple tutorial for beginners and here we are going to learn how to use surface tools and create this simple bottle in SOLIDWORKS I hope you like it so let's start to make this one with the help of surface tool this is the our bottle drawing so we are going to create with the help of surface tool so we will start with base top plane and we will create multiple planes first then we will draw this structure so our plane side distance is first we will create 50 millimeter then same four types of plane 50 100 150 200 4 in same distance then fifth plane is 30 millimeter then again sixth plane 10 millimeter and the last plane 5 millimeter above from the fifth uh, sixth plane so let's create a plane then we will decide the geometry now this is solid of interface just right click and choose your surface if you don't have unit we will keep millimeter so let's start first we will choose top plane reference geometry plane and now here we will create 50 millimeter plane but we need four number of planes two three four see we need to create four number of planes now you will see one two three four now select the top fourth plane again choose plane this one 30 millimeter above okay now the fifth plane now choose fifth plane plane and this one 10 millimeter okay now six plane let's choose six plane and the last plane is only 5 millimeter above from the uh, okay here selected plane 5 so delete and choose plane 6 5 millimeter above okay so here we created 7 planes for 7 kind of geometry now here we will start with base at the base we will create our basic geometries we will create oblong so that oblong is 75 by 45 millimeter okay then next two planes we have 100 by 60 millimeter of ob oblong uh, ellipse sorry not oblong it's ellipse then the last plane have 35 by 60 millimeter on third plane so i'll show you you will even see the view with the help of this view then there are four circles 40 20 35 25 22 see this is the smaller one uh, it's like 25 then the bigger one 40 then 35 then 22 the last one so we will start with top plane this is our top plane a sketch normal let's create ellipse not oblong actually it's ellipse now what we will do select these two points make relation vertical and uh, let me define the dimension this is basic one 75 millimeter forty five millimeter enter now simply exit now what we will do we will copy this to f up to three number of planes okay we will copy up to three number of select sketch go to edit and choose your copy now plane one choose plane one edit paste now see at plane one we paste now again we will choose we already copy so choose plane 2 edit paste now here also paste plane 3 paste okay now select fourth sketch circle 25 exit now this one we will again do one thing select this plane circle copy now let's 
try for fifth paste plane six paste plane seven edit paste now one by one we will edit the ground one is 75 the, this one second one is just click edit sketch now here 100 millimeter 60 millimeter now see drawing is not fully defined so choose center point just drag somewhere and again fix on the point see it is fully defined exit oh, that's so simple and the plane 2 also the same here choose edit sketch hundred sixty enter drag somewhere and fix exit okay now let's come to the plane third click on the edges or line a sketch this one is 60 by 35 okay exit now here we need to rotate now 25 this one is fixed plane 5 edit sketch 40 it's move and fix on the exit now let's choose plane 6 edit 35 millimeter exit now the last one click on the last one edit sketch and 22 exit now we will hide all the planes first so select plane 1 sketch uh, shift and select all hide now it's time to use surface tool looped surface first i'll choose this one second corner third corner fourth corner and this time select this end to all circles now here just do one thing drag outside all the green points so that we will get a perfect shape so we dragged all out exit look this is how we created a shape bottom choose planar surface and click the edge and see it's going to filled okay it's closed now let's create this structure first we will create this 20 millimeter this above radius 110 and distance see 120 millimeter 18 millimeter from bottom 45 millimeter radius r9 so we will create and i'll show you how to fix on the surface we will choose front plane a sketch normal line draw a line go back and it will automatically convert an arc uh, 
again go back and see you will see a again go back and you will see a curve again go back go back and create it now here select the point tangent relation let's define center point and draw one vertical center point click vertical okay let's create some relation hold shift key select this two and the middle one make relation symmetric okay the same thing select this two outer one center line symmetric relation okay let's try dimension 120 mm 45 mm 9 mm the corner radius 20 mm this radius and this radius 110 mm now see drawing is fully defined exit now we want to fix this sketch on the surface so what we will do drop down the menu project curve and choose here sketch on surface here i'll select sketch and second in second box choose face so i'll choose this face okay see it is comes here now i want to create some more thing here swift we want to make a cut out so we will use swift surface circular profile i'll choose path but the diameter is too big 3 mm that is sufficient okay now see now we will mirror this so let me do one thing mirror drop down and choose plane front plane and bodies to mirror let me choose this body now see it is mirror now let me do one thing click this blue line hide now we want to create a groove here so simply we will use surface trim surface click mutual so that we will easily able to get select surface 1 2 3 and here remove selection so select here okay now select upper one once you select upper one you will get inside surface see select inside also you have to select two surfaces okay i'll choose outer one then again you will see there is inside surface select inside surface and see you will get a depth hollow depth portion okay oh look how we created now let's do one thing combine this all because there are how many bodies one and two bodies so uh, okay let's combine later first you, we will use ruled surface tool select sweep length we will make 15 mm here we need to define a reference plane so i'll choose top plane and here i'll choose edge you will see this is the top plane reference plane reference vector and this is edge going upward side 15 mm now here we have three bodies so what we will do we will choose net surface and we will combine this all 1 2 3 let's say okay 
and now here only one body fill it two millimeter and let me choose all both side fill is going to take little time because calculation may need more time let's say okay and bottom fillet also we decided to keep 10 mm so this is the only simple tool things we are going to create with the help of tool or uh, here also we need to define 2 mm radius we are not going to assign any thickness we just i just want to show how to create a simple model now edit appearance solid orange now select the face and go to decal logos click decals and here select browse and we have a logo for this tied company logo it's reverse so simply i'll go to mapping here mirror horizontally that's perfect now let me increase height so that it looks more better One twenty. It seems better. Oh, look. So this is the simple tutorial how we created a simple bottle with the help of surface tool. I hope you like it. Don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in SolidWorks. Thanks for watching.